I'm Emily Longnecker in Indy's Hawville neighborhood, where residents on Traub Avenue, like Andre Walters Jr., are tired of hearing gunshots. Gunshots every night. Gunshots every night. It's not a night that you don't hear gunshots. Just three weeks ago, neighbors endured three days of drive-by shootings, sometimes right in broad daylight. Shooting out of a cannon. Boom, 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 boom. I mean, that's crazy. Clarence Brookins and his wife Joyce called 911 every time. I said, come over here now, they're shooting. And they come. And officers came back Wednesday, this time with the mayor and chief of police, to listen to people explain why they don't want to sit on their front porches anymore or let their kids play outside. You know, where I come from, nobody likes to see the police come through. But when they need it, they're needed. So the crime watch is going OK? And folks here say they do. I say more police presence up and down these streets. IMPD says beyond just walking down the street and shaking some hands, they've also increased patrols in the area and are helping the folks who live here start a crime watch. If you don't stand for something, you'll fall for anything. Mm -hmm. And I think that should be a motto of our crime watch. Andre Walters has his own message for the people shooting on his street. The street justice, it's enough of that. It's enough of that, and it needs to come to a halt.